Now as you learned in the previous training videos where we can go to enter in our actuals, it's basically the tracking table. I mean you can be in any view and pull up the tracking table. For example, I'm in the task sheet view. I can come over here and right click on the collapse view bar and go to the Gantt chart view here and just click and drag the split bar over so I don't see the chart of the Gantt chart. And this is the entry table. If I come up here and say view and go down to table and change it to the tracking table, I mean you get the same table here. You've got your tasks, you've got your actual start, finish, everything that we just saw in the uh, last couple of training videos. Except over here I've got my uh, Gantt chart as well, which is nice if I wanted to take a look at the uh, bars over here. In fact, while we're here, let's go ahead and complete another task, interview subject matter experts. Again, I can come in here and type in 100% complete or come over to the actual work and say that we completed. Well, you'll notice that the duration is two days. We'll just type in 16, hit enter. Again, eight hours a day, 16 hours. So the actual duration goes from the remaining duration of zero days to the actual duration of two days, which again, that's a total of 16 hours. Now, as a side note, after you mark a percentage complete of the task or you enter in the actual work, Project automatically calculates the actual and remaining work and cost for the resources assigned to the task. I like that, but if you don't like this and you want to do it manually, then you want to come up here, click on the Tools menu, go down to Options, come up here and click on the Calculation tab, and you want to uncheck this, Updating Task Status, Updates Resource Status. So if you update a task status 100%, it's automatically going to update the status of the resource. In any case, I like where it's at, but nonetheless, you can choose to uncheck that if you'd like, and I'll click Cancel. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel, get notified of the latest videos, and for only $2 a month, you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos.